Today we're going to talk about how to use a controller while playing the game Trophy Trout. Now it's going to function just like you would expect with any other controller on any other video game. The key mappings are going to be the same. So if we want to go forward, the left but the left stick, you go forward. Press back on the left stick and you go backwards. Strafe to the left or strafe to the right. And then this stick on the right is going to be our stick we view things with. So we want to look up, press up. We want to look down, look down. If we want to go to the left as we go forward, we just use both sticks at the same time. Pressing forward, left or right, is how you basically travel around the world. Great. So now I'm going to press the menu button. And in the menu system, I use the D-pad here to go up and down to select the menu. Let's go to the store for a minute. All right, I'm in the store, and again, I go left and right. I'm come over here to the waiter section. I'll press A, and you can see some of the things are locked, but the Weekend Warrior is unlocked. Now I'm going to press A, and I'm going to purchase that. Great. I now own a pair of Weekend Waiters. Now, if I press it again, you can see the Weekend, sorry, Warrior Waiters are now mine. They have a little checkbox by them. If you want to exit the menu at any time, you just press B and that closes it. Awesome. All right, so how do we catch a fish? Well, you can come over here and look in the water for some fishies. Oh, I see a toad right there. Now, I'm going to go ahead and cast a little bit in front of them and show you how to retrieve the line first. Right trigger is going to make that cast. And the left trigger will bring that trick back. We'll bring the trigger back. Okay, so again, if we want to do the line, right line casts, and the left line brings it back. The left trigger brings back the line. All right, so that's how to cast and retrieve. Now, what about catching a fish? Well, first of all, we need the right fly. So blue winged olives are hatching, and we have one on, but I'm going to go ahead and show you how to select the fly. Press the menu button, go to the store, come over here to flies, and if you want to change flies, you go to the left or to the right. And that'll take you through the menu system to change your flies. Now if you want to buy some or tie some, you go up and down. And then you can buy whatever fly that you, that you want or tie it by pressing the A button. And you can see you get more flies and your materials go down. Cool. So we have some of those. All right, well, let's try to catch a fish now. Now I'm going to press the trigger button. Boom, fish rises. Press up to set the hook, and then follow the arrows on the screen. So down, green arrow says left. I'm pressing left on the D-pad. I'm pressing up on the D-pad, and I goofed it up a little bit. I, I, uh, I must have pressed a little left or right. It's pretty sensitive. So let's try one more time. Fish on. Great, nice, we caught a fish. And we unlocked some tying materials, 140's worth. Cool, all right, so that's pretty much how you use the controller. And the only thing that you uh, are gonna wanna be aware of is that reeling in and, and letting slack out in the advanced levels are gonna be using the X and Y buttons. So while you're pressing those arrows, you're also gonna be hitting those, and the, potentially the D-pad. Now, if you have any question, you can hit the menu. You can always come in here to the help section look up the controller, and see what the actual controls are for how to play the game. And that's it. Thanks for watching.